Hello, Radical Resistors. My name is Jim Matulski, and I'm glad to co-host this year's LGBTQ Religious Archives Network Gala called Radical Resistance. And I'm especially pleased and honored to be doing it with Dr. Emily Towns, an inspiring liberation theologian whose work has inspired me and I know many of you. We're gathering at this gala to celebrate radical resistance. And anyone who has ever stood up against religious homophobia and helped create a place for queer people in religion or spirituality is a radical resistor. We've identified six this year who particularly embody this. And we hope that you will join us as we honor people like Dr. Mel White, author of Stranger at the Gate, and someone who really blew open the evangelical Christian world by telling the truth. We're celebrating Rabbi Denise Egger, who as the spiritual leader of one of Los Angeles's premier synagogues, through her example, through her preaching, through her activism, literally changed Judaism and how it regards LGBTQ people. And I'm especially pleased that we're honoring Bishop Yvette Flunder, my bishop. I'm a minister in the Metropolitan Community Churches, in the United Church of Christ, and in the Fellowship of Affirming Ministries. And I am at all of those intersections because of the work that I have witnessed firsthand on multiple continents that Bishop Yvette Flunder does. She brought the Azusa Street Pentecostal movement into the 21st century, even before it was ready to do so. Those are just three of the honorees, and I'm gonna ask you to do a few things. First, go to the website and register for the event. It's free. Secondly, read the biographies of all six honorees and the ways that they have been leaders in radical resistance. You can find their biographies there. And I'm also asking you, thirdly, to tell people about this gala and get them to register too. And finally, I'm asking you to show up on October 22nd as we celebrate radical resistors and as we all move forward in the radical resistance movement.